Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy No Life Simi. I'm back with another video. And in today's video, I just wanted to show y'all me chopping it up with another manufacturer because, like, as a clothing brand owner, we're, we plan on scaling, right? So we're gonna need a lot of options. Like, we can't just stick to one manufacturer. I already told y'all this. I have a, I have like two manufacturers right now, and you want to keep branching out because certain manufacturers do things better than others, and you don't just want to stop at that one manufacturer because there could be even better manufacturers that do the same exact thing but cheaper with the same good quality. So like every day, I don't know. I kind of made it a part of my routine to always contact a manufacturer. You get what I'm saying? Um, it's gonna be a follow up to this video right here, finding a manufacturer to order my new clothing brand samples. Um, I, I I need to come up with some new samples. I need to design. Yo, if you're a designer. Hit my DMs on IG, link in bio, hit my DMs. I wanna see a designer, I wanna work with a designer like one-on-one -on -one personally, so I can tell them what I like and how I want it done. And I know they'll do a better job than me, but I have ideas and I, it's hard to put them on a on thing cause it's like, I don't really know how to do it. Like I'm still a beginner y'all, so I wanna FaceTime or talk one-on-one -on -one with a designer and we can really get right. Um, I'm gonna just show y'all these DMs I had with a Pakistan manufacturer. So. All the time, I always went through Chinese or China manufacturers, but people always told me Pakistan manufacturers was kind of good too, and the turnaround time is fast. So I went and tested that out for y'all. Um, these are the DMs right here. So y'all know when y'all have a clothing brand, they just be in y'all DMs, sir, da 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 da, sir, we're a clothing brand, we make clothes. So I'm like, you know what? I know all y'all not scams. Some of y'all actually want customers. So let me hit one of y'all up. So one of them was in my um my comments so i was like okay cool let's see what they talking about she said hello dear attention please you know they don't speak english because hello dear attention please nah that's not like a that's not like a proper sentence like that you would come at somebody you get what i'm saying but i already know they like from pakistan or whatever hello dear attention please whatever thankful sir for your attention this is a crazy sentence we are twinter international a clothing brand manufacturer company our factory with the strength da, 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 they make whatever and look look what they said their mrq was one to ten pieces so i'm like damn that's low-key a green light in my head because i'm a small brand and a lot of chinese manufacturers don't work with you unless you're doing at least 40 like a lot of them always say 50 you could get them down to 40 but it's kind of hard so i'm like when i seen that i'm like okay this is green flag i'm like okay this is cool like then she says any colors we will quote a price whatever so I text them back. I said I would like a sample. I sent them the flares that I worked on, you know, some nice pants that I worked on. So <clears throat> um the manufacturer said, sir, which size you want? I said medium. She said, um, I, my fault. I said, what would be the price of the sample? Right? They go on and say, sir, 80 each sample. Whoa, slow your roads. The Chinese people don't even charge 80. Slow your roads. That's already a red flag. So you know, you know what I, I'm gonna do what I do and talk to them. You know what I'm saying? You always get a lower price. I'm telling you, first price is never the goal, ever. I go and say, oh man, well, I have a manufacturer doing it for 60, which is true. I'm not even lying, this is true. But the turnaround time is a little bit slower. That's why I reach out to you. Cause I heard Pakistan turnaround time is really fast, like way fi faster than China. And as y'all know, China right now is in a uh, Chinese New Year, so I have to wait till February. So I'm like, while I'm waiting, let me find another manufacturer. You get what I'm saying? All right, so I then respond and said, if I can't get 60 or lower, then I won't be working with you. Tell them plain and simple. They say, okay, sir. Sir, you want 100% cotton? Sir, you will send me 60. So off rip, they're like, oh, nah. He not working on less 60? All right, well, let's drop the 60. Um. I probably should have demanded more, which I probably will do. I'm not gonna lie. I probably demand a little bit lower because you see how quick they were to like, once I peep, once I said, oh, I'm not gonna be working with y'all if y'all not working. They immediately said, okay, we'll do 60. You get what I'm saying? So then they go on to say, sir, don't worry. We'll send your DHL Express. If y'all don't know that it's the fastest shipping you can get, DHL Express. So I said, I want the MLQ to be 12, uh, 12 pieces. Mind you, this is not a real order. I just want to see where their head is at because I don't actually want this from this manufacturer. I I gotta test them out with T's. I don't trust them with certain, you know what I'm saying? I don't trust, it's certain manufacturers, like when I'm first, first ordering them, I don't trust them with like, um, things like this because it's flare pants, it has three different fabrics on it, like you gotta cut and sew this, you get what I'm saying? 
and it's like puff printed and screen printed on the bottom so it's a lot and for the first time i don't want them to mess it up and i'm like <clears throat> I'll, I'll i'll see what the quality is like on some tees right so i'll probably message them after this but i go on to say um yeah twelve dollars i want it to be at least twelve dollars um at most um per product right so she says sir how much piece do you want i said 12 um she said sir you will send me the 12 without shipping cost so off rip i already got her to 12 dollars per product um this doesn't include shipping so 12 12s is 144 12 times 12 is 144 shipping will probably be a hundred dollars around there that'll be like two two something close to 300 dollars. i'll pay for 12 sweats probably like 250 around there 260 but i will sell the sweats for 55 dollars possibly get like six hundred dollars on the back end my profit would be um around four something you know what i'm saying but this is just for one color so really and truly this is an amazing deal i can't even lie this is an amazing deal um i then say sure she said send me your logo i said before we work how fast will i get my product remember um i did a video on this on questions you should be asking your manufacturer that's moq sample prices and um the turnaround time is extremely important you know what i'm saying they go on and say sir two days to make the product three days for shipping that's five days in total i could damn near get my product the same week they was not playing about these pakistan manufacturers damn near the same week i could get my product which is amazing right um i'm gonna leave this i'll, I'll just show the manufacturer up top because i probably wouldn't use them but I'm going I'm to show y'all, just in case y'all do want to work with them, because a lot of y'all need manufacturers. A lot of y'all hit me up. This is probably a manufacturer I will work with, but don't don't um quote me word for word on this. I've never used them. I don't know how they get down. I don't know the quality. I don't know if they'll scam you. I do not know. But right now, what the way they're talking to me, this seems like a good manufacturer. As far as like pricing and turnaround time, I can almost get myself the same week. Come on now. Um... <clears throat> They, they say, sir, I will use DHL Express. You take your parcel two and three days. So five days, I'll get my product, basically, right? So I said, okay, I will send you the logo, pitch when I get home, because I was at work at the time. And then they said, okay, sir, I'm waiting. Um, and then they were basically just spamming me because I never I never hit them back. I'm kind of just now seeing all this, though, but I'm a, um, I probably would work with them. I'm just going to send them a, another um, sample that I want. I'm going to probably get a shirt, and I'll get the shirt down price probably to, like, twenty dollars because she just went sixty dollars on on some pants that they had a that had three different fabrics puff print screen printing i also added jaw strings with um gold tips at the end and she was gonna do it for 60 you get what i'm saying including shipping so i think i could get a t-shirt for around 25 30 dollars including shipping so um <clears throat> i don't know but if y'all just to show y'all they do take um western union and moneygram they don't take like I, you know how China, you could just use your debit, whatever. They they use Western Union and, and MoneyGram. Just a heads up if you do want to go through Pakistan. You get what I'm saying? Um, <clears throat> That's pretty much going to be the video. I just wanted to show you guys the DMs I had with the Pakistan manufacturer, which was also my first time. And I just wanted to show y'all, if y'all did want to go ahead with Pakistan manufacturers, y'all know a lot of Pakistan manufacturers are on Instagram. And Alibaba and stuff has like... Um, a lot of Chinese manufacturers. So Pakistan turnaround is extremely fast, y'all. I'm not gonna lie, it's extremely fast. This is them right here, clothing underscore MFG underscore USA. If y'all did want to go ahead, this is a free menu. I've never used them though. I've never used them. I don't know what they do. I don't know if they scam. I I don't know. Don't attach me to that. But I did have a a pretty good conversation with them as far as prices and turnaround time. It was a green light. I just never sent no money to them nothing so to each its own on that y'all do your own thing but this is them i just wanted to show y'all that that's pretty much gonna be the video um make sure y'all like comment subscribe i'm gonna chop this up real quick edit it and upload this um if i do upload this today it's going up around like five i'm about to ask y'all right now to see if y'all would even want this today or should i just upload it tomorrow um other than that if anybody know live simi um website is still live in description it's a couple more left sales been slow it's like it's like when you got a couple left, it's the hardest to get gone. Like I'm about to go do a pop-up shop or something just to get the rest off. But um, I guess in the beginning of the days, everybody wants to shop and do this. But when you start slowing up and running out of product, 
nobody wants to get the rest of the product gone. Like, I got a couple shirts left. Y'all go shop, man. Yeah. Link in bios, me boy, no life see me. Also, like I said earlier, if you're a designer, please hit me up, hit my DMs. We can talk prices. And also, I need somebody to make my thumbnails. I, I don't have enough time to put actual time into my thumbnails. So, I mean, they're okay, but I do want the top of the line. I'm trying to upgrade quality. I'm trying to make it on YouTube, get a viral video, quit my job, buy cameras, and then we really in it, y'all. I love y'all so much. It's been more than life to me. Discord down below. I'm gone.